magkakaroon tayo ng Hulday Review. Mag-review tayo ng Hulday with Shawil Products. I have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 products right here from Shawil na i-review natin and iisa-isahin natin sila. Shawil Makeup BC Stick right here. And then, I have the Shawil Makeup Eyeshadow 5 Color Makeup Professional right here in 004. Shawil Makeup Terracotta Blusher. Shawil Makeup Eyeliner Pencil na long-lasting and waterproof. And then, I have here the Smooth Long-Lasting Liquid Eyeliner Pen. And lastly, meron ako dito Light Color Guide Charm Color Lipstick. Ito siya. Unahin na natin itong kanilang busy stick right here. Ito yung kanyang itsura and packaging. 350 yata ito, if I'm not mistaken. Pinuksan niya siya. Ito siya. Very sophisticated packaging. I love it. Ito yung product. And then, on the other side, it has a brush. A little, you know, observation. Sa lahat ng mga Pinoy brands na meron tayo dito sa Pilipinas, siya will pa lang nakikita ko na medyo innovative in terms of... Innovative yung marami silang pakulo in terms of their lines. This side, naglagay ako ng primer. So, unahin natin to. And, basahin natin siya. Siya will make up busy stick premium mineral. It's comfortable daily based makeup item. Busy stick covers pores and blemishes. BC plus CC plus sun, sunscreen plus pore, pore balm plus concealer plus foundation plus essence. Dami, diba? So let's do this on the side muna na, mer na wala akong primer. Yun na nga yung sinasabi ko yung maliit eh. <laughs> Ang liit ng brush. I don't think I'm gonna continue with this brush kasi medyo hindi niya ini-even yung busy stick on my face. Uh, this is better. Tsaka mas malambot. Ang tigas ng brush nito eh. Okay, i-try ko to with um, sponge. Okay naman siya with brush. Yung brush na different brush, not the brush na along with nitong busy stick. Hindi ko siya masyadong gusto kasi medyo matigas siya. So, sa brush, okay naman siya. Wala namang streak or something. Let's try with Sponge. Everything is better with sponge. <laughs> okay. So, ito yung side na may busy stick. Ito yung side na wala. Absolutely bilong niya itsura ng kutis ko. And parang medyo kinunsil niya rin yung pores ko. And gusto ko yung finish niya kasi mukha siyang natural lang. Hindi siya mukhang merong kasuot. Which I love personally. Yung mga visible na discoloration niya and like redness right here. At saka yung mga veins. Hindi niya ganun makukover. Again, same problem you guys with Pinoy products. Walang masyadong option ng shade. I think this has three shades available on it. So, yun. I think this one is the middle shade. Meron pang lighter dito and medyo meron pang darker. Mas maganda talaga ang may primer. Pero okay din naman ang wala kasi medyo na hide nyo naman yung pores ko pero hindi ganun ka hide unlike ng my primer now let's continue on with the Shawil makeup eyeshadow in 004 I think meron silang apat nito 001 ito yung pinaka dulo open nyo siya it has a mirror right there and then yung mga shade watch natin tong white muna wala nang paglagyan. Malambot yung ano nito. Yung kanyang texture. And full pigment naman, ay, as you can see right there. Too shimmery for me. Nawala nang pang transition. So, I'm gonna use my bronzer right here. Na to. Medyo powder ito, guys. So, be careful lang. I'm gonna put this on my inner corner. So far, walang fallout sa aking under eyes. This shade right here. And ilalagay ko siya sa middle naman. Hanggang sa outer. Ang galing, wala pa rin fallouts. Kahit biniblend ko na. I'm gonna get this shade. Tapos parang ibiblend ko sa aking crease. A little, a little, a little goes sa loob. Kahit medyo powdery siya on the pan, sa mata ko hindi. Walang fallout whatsoever. Kahit blenen ko na and all that. So, yun. Buti na lang. Matte yung black nila. So, I'm gonna get that matte black. Lalagay ko siya sa outer. 
Oh, this is really intense lang. I'm gonna get yung white just to highlight yung aking inner. Ano ba tawag dito? Diyan. Paririn na natin to. Kukunin ko to ulit. Ito to. Shade na to. At ilalagay ko sa outer half ng aking lower. Ang eyeliner pencil right here which is 59 pesos. Nakalagay dito long lasting and waterproof siya. Baka I mess up nito yung makeup ko. Ang ganda pa naman. 59 pesos lang to. Kung maganda to, super duper mura to for a waterproof and long lasting na pencil. As in, wow, lalo lumaki yung mata. O, ano pang ilalaki na mata? <laughs> yep, meron tong puti na to. So, kung naghahanap kayo ng puti, maganda to. Pero hindi natin alam kung long lasting siya. I'm gonna get the black one kasi ako yung mag fight line. Yup. Hindi siya ganun ka black na black, pero it will show. Now we're gonna open this sa Will Makeup Smooth Long Lasting 24-Hour Meticulous Softhead Liquid Eyeliner right here. Gives you so many ways to define your eyes from the lasting intensity to the ultra-blendable artistry. Create a dark intense line for dramatic eye impact smudge on a softer, softer line to create ultimate smoky eye. Wow. Pwede pala tong smudge. At saka meron siya tumutulog sa loob. It's very satisfying. <laughs> Touch natin to. Ooh. I like how intense yung color payoff na nilalabas niya. As you can see right there. Yan. Ang ganda ng eyeliner na to. Tuloy-tuloy ako. Dalawang minuto na gumagawa ng isa. Pero hindi ko sinasara at binubuksan. Ang ganda. This one right here. This one is the Terracotta Blusher. Usually, pag texturize yung mukha nyo, hindi maganda ang shimmer um, blushes. Pero yung mga blushes nila kasi, ayan, bake siya. And hindi masyadong okay to if you have texturized face. Yung may mga pores kayo kasi talaga ma-emphasize niya. However, upon watching this, parang mas maganda siya as highlighter. Ayan. Ayan o. Oh. Unang-unang nagkwento sa akin ito is si Danaline. Magpo-comment yun. Hi, Dana! Kaya ako, nakalimutan ko na ito bilhin. Pero, this is for you. Kasi, ikaw nagsabi sa akin ito. Eh, totally nakalimutan ko na. Sa liking ko. Oh my gosh! This is highlight. Ang lakas nito maka-fresh. I'm gonna get yung gold na onte Kasi masyadong pink. Ang gusto nyong highlighter, ito. Ang gamitin nyo, tsaka ito. Pag gusto nyo ng blush, you can get that one. Oo siya, fine na fine. Pero, na-overwhelm lang ako. So, i-blend natin ito ng very, very light. Lalagay ko siya dito. Sa tip lang. Pag tip. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I like my I like my look so far. Last one, magmamaya na lang ako ng mascara off cam. But this one is the She Will Makeup Like Color Guide Charm Color Lipstick in 02. Ganda ng shade nito nung ini-swatch ko. The lipstick right here at magnetize siya, you guys. Galing. Overly scented lang, pero okay naman. Ito yung kanyang shade. Yeah, ang ganda-ganda ng shade na to. Okay, let's do this. This is matte pala, you guys. Ah. Hindi siya yung one, one glide show color kagad. Wala ka mararamdaman. Wala. Wala siyang transfer. Ah, meron. Very, very light transfer. 9-12 ng umaga in I'll get back to you later on 7.02 ng gabi so magti 10 hours na since gamit ko itong mga products na to magsimula tayo sa BC Cream until now maganda pa rin yung itsura niya andun pa rin yung products sa akin and then also maganda rin yung ability niya na mag 
hide ng pores ng very very light. A little lang yung difference ng side na may um, primer compare sa walang primer. Nagblot na pala ako guys. 6 hours during the time na nakamakeup ako. 6 hours nagblot ako and until now ito na yung mukha ko. Ito ang nakuhang oil sa aking mukha. Medyo marami rin. I think for oily skin, okay tong product na to. However, for those who have drier skin na maraming pagbabalat, this will absolutely emphasize yung pagbabalat nyo. Kasi nakikita ko yung pagbabalat ko dito. Nakitang kita in this area also. So, hindi masyado siyang okay for those people na maraming pagbabalat na nagaganap sa mukha. I think this is a good product for those who have oily skin kasi maganda yung longevity ng oil control niya. And also, yung product until now, andun pa rin. And it's very, very blooming sa face. Papakita ko sa inyo yung picture taken ko, yung natural lighting. Ang ganda ng itsura niya. Even in photography, maganda rin siya. Ito yung photography. Ang ganda ng itsura ng BC cream na to. So, just don't use the brush along with it. I would rate 1 to 5, guys. 1 being the lowest and and 5 being the highest. Itong BC Steak, I would rate this 3. So, tama lang. Eyeshadow, wala ako masabi sa eyeshadow na to. Plakadong plakado until na walang bawas yun pa rin. This area, usually, pag nag eyeshadow kasi ako, pag hindi magandang klase ng eyeshadow yung gamit ko, talagang nagkikrease yan. Pero as you can see, close up, though nag-oil up na yung buong mukha ko, walang nag-crease sa kanya, walang nanuot dun sa mga lines sa eyes ko, so, okay na okay to. Maraming mga colors sila. So, go ahead and check their eyeshadow lines. Kasi ang ganda. Ang ganda ng color payoff niya. Ang ganda. Wala siyang fallouts. do foils to. Wala nalaglag. Even though nag-blend na ako during the time na na-apply ko siya. Walang nalaglag. Maganda yung, maganda yung quality ng powder nito. And also, talagang oh, a little goes a long way sa kanya. So, ang ganda ng eyeshadow na to. I highly recommend this. Kasi maganda siya. At yung longevity niya maganda. Until now, kahit konti, walang nagbago, walang naalis, walang nag-crease. So, uh, for 188 pesos, I truly, truly recommend this. Maraming shade ang available na to. If you want to try their eyeshadow, maganda. A big thumbs up to. I would give this a good 4.5. Kung natitirang 0.5, it's for Shawil to have a more range ng matte shadows. Hindi naman lahat nagpo-foil eyeshadow. Like for everyday neutral, si mga ganon, and matte. I, sana maglabas ang Shawil ng matte shades nila sa line na to kasi ang ganda ng quality ng eyeshadow. Shawil makeup eyeliner right here. I would give this a good 5. Maganda yung quality ng eyeliner na to. Papakita ko sa inyo tong eyeliner na to. Ito, kanina umaga ko to nung iniswatch ko sa inyo tong eyeliner na to. Yan, yan na yun. Naghugas na ako siguro mga around 10 times today at walang nawala dyan as in yan na yan pa rin. So this is absolutely waterproof and smudge proof as well kasi sa mata ko walang nawala and kung ano yung lagay ko kanina yun na yun kahit yung line ko sa gilid walang nawala. And also, napansin ko sa kanya kasi nung nag-curler ako, walang transfer sa kanya. Absolutely, you have to dry this up para walang transfer sa curler nyo. So, first time ko maka-experience ng uh, liquid eyeliner na walang transfer sa curler. Nira-apply ko to sa mata ko just to check kung okay siya to double layer. Okay na okay siya to double layer. So, I highly recommend this. And this is very affordable, you guys. 128 pesos lang siya. And also, yung upon application ko sa kanya, hindi ko siya tinataktak ng tinataktak, guys, ha? Yung isang open ko, good for one, one eye na yun. And, yun. I super recommend this eyeliner. Very affordable for 128 pesos. Maganda na, na rin siya kasi felt tip siya. Ito pang maganda na to, super hygienic to and super secure, guys. Kasi super sikip ng cover niya to the point na kailangan nyo talaga siyang i-push. Ayan o, pag hindi nyo siya pinush ng maayos, Ibig, hindi siya nasasara. Maganda yun, ibig sabihin, masikip siya to the point na hindi magda-dry up kagad yung liquid eyeliner nyo. Yan. So, you have to really like close it. Hindi siya basta-basta rin na open Ibig sabihin, it will seal the liquid in. That will make the product last longer. Kasi, ibig sabihin, mas matagal siya magda-dry up. Now, let's continue on with this eyeliner pencil, long-lasting and waterproof nila, which is the white and the black. The white is still there. Yung nilagay ko kanina andun pa rin. Absolutely. This is only 58 pesos, you guys. And then, sa aking tight line, meron pa naman. Yung iba nag-bleed na. Ay, kanina nakita ko, nag-transfer na siya on my lower. 
at saka nag-bleed siya dito sa gilid. I give this like a 2.5. Okay na siya in between. Highlighter, you guys. I think I found a good highlighter right here. Ang ganda niya. Until now, andun pa rin siya. So, you can see, nag-glow pa rin yung aking skin. Nandiyan pa rin siya. Pag minatch nyo siya, lahat sama-sama, maganda siyang blush. Especially kung kayo yung tipo ng tao na wala masyadong pores, ang ganda to blush this one. Kasi it will give you that that healthy glow ang itsura. Ganun yung itsura niya. And a little goes a long way. Kasi kanina, konting brush ko lang sa kanya. Talagang kitang-kita mo yung color niya. And ang ganda nung shade. Actually, marami to. This one is the number one. I think hanggang tatlong shade ang meron sila nito. Thank you, Dana, for suggesting this to me. I think a year ago nung sinagest mo sa akin to. Ngayon ko lang nabili. But a good-good product to try as in magandang highlighter to and a blush as well if you want that glow. Just secure your pores kasi ma-emphasize ng shine, ang um, pores, and texture, you guys. So, beware lang doon. But aside from that, if you have a good primer to conceal those pores, maganda itsura niya kasi sa akin kanina ang ganda ng itsura niya. Until now, andun pa rin yung product. So, I think this one is a long-lasting product as well. I will give this product a good 4. Color lipstick right here. Oh, hey, you guys. Ang ganda ng color na to. But again, this one is a lipstick. Habang ginagamit nyo siya, nag-fade siya. And then, unti-unting nawawala. Pero hindi ganun kalaking drastic ang pagkawala ng product na to. So, yun. And then, also, upon application, you guys, medyo, wala naman ako naramdaman na thugging. And, yun lang, you have to, like, really do it just to get the color payoff. Yung hindi ganun kaganda yung color payoff niya eh. So you have to really like glide in siguro mga tatlong layer just to get this shade right here. Yung talagang full color niya bago mo niyong makuha. So tatlong beses ko in swipe. Pero maganda siya. Magandang klase ng match siya kasi wala kayo mararamdaman. This is very very lightweight. Hindi siya. Yan ang problema kasi sa matte lipstick. Medyo mararamdaman niyo yung product eh na nandoon. Pero ito, talagang wala kang mararamdaman at all. As in ngayon, wala akong nararamdaman na meron ako lipstick. So, this is very, very lightweight. And also, ang ganda ng packaging niya, you guys. Ayan, no? As in, sealed na sealed din. I'll give this a 3 for 228 pesos. Medyo may makukuha ka na na mas murang lipstick, matte lipstick na mas maganda magbilis yung color payoff. Pero kasi lightweight kasi ito eh. Ang ganda kasi niya, ang sarap niya sa lips, wala kang mararamdaman. Sige, nataasan natin ng konti. I'll give this a 3.5. Lahat sila nagustuhan ko, as in, lahat sila nagustuhan ko. Walang lugi, I mean, walang lugi sa pera ko ngayong araw na to. <laughs> Buying this product, I truly love them all. So, yun lang. Just con take consideration sa mga sinabi ko kanina, kung gusto niyo silang bilhin. Uh, yung mga downfall nila and yung magagandang qualities nila. But basically, yung pencil lang ang hindi ko masyadong nagustuhan dito. But aside from that, all of them are good products to try. That's it for this video. I hope you guys enjoy watching it. If you did, please do give me a big thumbs up. And thank you, thank you very much guys for watching. And I'll see you guys soon. Don't forget to be happy all the time and have a great day. Bye! If you want to watch me in my latest video, ito yan. At kung hindi ba kayo nagsusubscribe sa channel na to, yung pagmumukha ko dyan, i-click nyo. And all my social media handlers are here. So go ahead and check me out there. And I would like to say hi to Dana. Hello, Dana. Thank you for watching. I love you and I'll see you guys soon. Bye.